here we are for the Your Metal Express show. We are in Mexico City, and I'm here with Thomas from Terion. Yes, you are. I am here, and you are here, and how are you? I'm fine. I'm a little tired, but that's nothing, you know? Yes, sure. Mm -hmm. And you're going to play in Mexico for the second time this year? Yeah, we did Guadalajara yesterday, and yeah. it was great, but I think this is going to be greater. Yes, yeah. you sold out the tickets. Amazing. You know, every time we go on tour, I'm, I'm afraid that maybe nobody will come anymore, but it's the same every time. It's full, and I'm so happy for it, you know. Yeah, and in Mexico, you are, like, very loved. Yeah, I, I noticed, and it's great. <laughs> yes, it's like I saw that you ran a contest for the back of the stage. Yeah. And how does that work? Well, <clears throat> for, for this tour, we did, we did a, a contest for making, the, you know, the backdrop mm -hmm. drop. Yes. Um, and the winners could come backstage and see the show from backstage if they want, you know, to meet <laughs> yeah, the band. Yeah, for sure, they probably wouldn't. Yeah, the, <laughs> they are a little, you know, the, oh, it's f great to be here backstage to see the show, but it sounds better outside, you know. Really? And, yeah. They say that? <laughs> yeah, that does. It sounds horrible on stage. <laughs> <laughs> it's, but the main thing is that they meet you. Yeah, and they hang around, you know, and yeah, and mm. it's great. I don't mind at all. I think it's fun to have fans around. Yes, and I think that it's very important for you. I mean, I saw that you do contests and meet and greets. Yeah, I mean, basically the fans are our bosses. Yes. Without them, we're nothing. We can go back and work in the grocery store, <laughs> basically. And personally, I hate bands that say that, oh, it's so, such a, uh, it's... Um, so difficult when the fans are in the airport and when they surround the band. Mm -hmm. Don't complain, give the job to somebody that wants it. Yes, yes. Know. I saw that in the fan page of Therion here in mm -hmm. Mexico, they were saying, no, they are going to the airport at that yeah, the they, time. They know it better than me. <laughs> it's like in the hotel, you just change the location and you still have fans out yeah. there. Yeah, but they, they are so dedicated to this, so they, they know before I know that we are going to play here. <laughs> and that's true. It's no exaggeration, it's like that. Yes, mm -hmm. and with Therion now you're in the tour, mm -hmm. and you're celebrating like the Bobbin album. Yeah, we're testing out, you know, we're, we're writing a rock opera. Mm -hmm. uh, it's called The Rise and Fall of Antichrist. Really? Mm -hmm. And it's a huge amount of work, and we wanted to go out on tour to try some pieces and play mm -hmm. it for for people and see what they think about it and so far we got very positive response really so you are playing new stuff yeah we're oh, playing like nice. a medley sort of like small excerpts mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. wow that's amazing yeah and any time for the new city uh, no <laughs> <laughs> it's a secret I don't know. <laughs> it's not a secret but i don't know really yet but i if i can estimate it i would think it's be out in a year Really? Yeah, but that's what I think. Okay. It might be half a year, it might be two years. You know, with mm -hmm. there, you, you never know. <laughs> no, <laughs> it's like amazing because the last city was two years ago. Yeah, you're and right. And why in French? It's Christopher's. It's in his head, you know. Mm -hmm. He has his ideas. We were, we were uh, touring Europe and mm -hmm. he was sitting in the tour bus silent, you know. All of a sudden he looks up. We're going to do a French album. <laughs> in French, covers, <laughs> and everybody was, what? <laughs> yeah. Did you just say yes? <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's, it's basically Chris Band, so, mm -hmm. and I thought it was a bad idea first. Uh, everybody thought that, but mm -hmm. he don't care about that, you know, so he, when he has an idea, he go for it. Yes. And now, looking back on it, he was right. It was, mm -hmm. it's a, it was a good selling album, and I'm, but I will never do it again. <laughs> Just once I don't speak French, you know, and I had a hell in the studio mm -hmm. to, to pronounce it right. I had a girl sitting with me, who, a French girl who helped me with the pronunciation and everything. Really? Mm -hmm. Amazing. Yeah. You have to study. Oh. <laughs> yes, yeah. and now you're going to change again the, yeah. you know, like the band. Lori is the last Laurie's show. Leaving, yeah. Yeah, it's her, her last show tonight, and um, it feels weird, it feels sad and weird, but 
hey, you gotta respect if somebody wants to leave you, you must let them, you know. Yes, and do you have any names for the tours? For the tours? Yeah, that means she's going to be in the studio in the next recording, right? Yeah, if, yeah, that she will be for mm -hmm. the opera, yeah. Mm -hmm. So it's not totally over between us, you know. No. But she will not tour anymore. Yeah, she just wants to stay home. Yeah, she, you know, she has, she wants to go back to have a normal life, you know. Mm -hmm. But I know how that is. I think she will miss this a lot. Yes, but you have your daughter here. I do. <laughs> I do. Yes, I have sure. function. It's that it's going good. I mean, when we're on tour, we're like colleagues. Mm -hmm. It's not so much father and daughter, and that's home, mm -hmm. you know, because it doesn't work like that. Because I cannot spy on her what she's doing, no. you know, mm -hmm. and she she are not allowed to spy on me what I'm doing <laughs> certainly. Yeah. Because it wouldn't work. No, it it's a work. different relationship. Yeah, and also she's a grown-up woman. Even if she's young, she's she do what she wants. Okay, that's yeah. great, and mm. I think that it's easy to. You don't miss that much your home when the family is around. Of course not. But I have another child at home that I mm -hmm. miss much. But you know, with today we have Skype and everything. You can mm -hmm. hi, how are you? Look, here's Mexico. You know, yeah. it's fantastic. <laughs> Tell me. <laughs> For let's say 25 years ago, if I s told you that, well, in the yeah. future we are gonna be able to speak with you know and. In yes. real time, you would think I'm crazy. Yes, probably. I mean, you're from Sweden, I'm from Mexico, yeah. we're making an English show, it's yeah. amazing, no? <laughs> and any kind of message for fans? I deeply love all the fans, mm -hmm. and especially here in Mexico, it's like a homecoming every time, you know? Yeah. It's very different. It's Yeah, it is. It, you, you have another... The connection with the fans here are so the fan base here are so strong, mm -hmm. you know, and I don't know why it's so. It's just is. It just, mm -hmm. It's great also to come, for example, to Colombia. It's it's very close to this, but Mexico have always been, you know, we end or we start the tour here all the time. Mm -hmm. So it's it's very special. It's very special, and I I love all the fans. Yes, I think that we also believe that it's like you made a DVD here. Yeah, um, exactly. Exactly. I think that that just grew the love that we feel for you. <laughs> so, yeah. It's amazing. And we, before I was in the band, they made a, a live DVD from Mexico. Mm -hmm. And now we're doing sort of like a, not a full concert, but a lot of filming around the stage, you know, backstage. And they will also film film from stage when, we, when we're playing. Mm -hmm. You know, so it's going to be fun. It's going to be fun. Yeah. That's for sure. And... Okay, tell me about your pets in your house. Do you have pets? Yeah, my daughter has a pet and she lives with me right now. She has a, a dog, a King Charles Cavalier Spaniel. <laughs> it has become my dog now because he sleeps with me, you know. Really? <laughs> yeah. And he him, misses you probably so much. I uh, probably scream. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, like he can't sleep yeah. because you're so far. And um, May I ask you yeah. something? Sure. The board game. Yes. What about it? Uh, Where I, you came to the idea? Well, that was fun. We played in Italy, mm -hmm. and a guy came up to us and presented this idea he had. Mm -hmm. and it sounded so cool when he said it, but it's one thing to have an idea, and it's another thing to make it fly. Yes. But he really did that, and we went down to to uh, Mil to uh, Torino in Italy. Mm -hmm. And also to Pisa, we sat in this. You have a signing session in a, in a, in a sort of how can I say convention for gamers. Okay. It was a totally new world for me. <laughs> I can't imagine yeah. <laughs> where I'm. Yes, very strange, but it was it was cool. And then we made a video of this uh, song mm -hmm. "Alla Luna Red Viva" uh, that that are based on the, the game story, so to speak. Mm -hmm. And personally, I didn't play the game. You did? <laughs> because it's so fucking complicated, <laughs> you know. It's like for experts. Yeah, it's for for these real real nerds, you know that. <laughs> but I have it at home, and I have these little men. That, yeah, yeah. your little youth. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but we we said it someday. Chris and I were speaking yesterday, and 
someday we're gonna meet and have some drinks and play mm -hmm. it, you know. <laughs> yeah, for some time. Yeah, but it, it's fun because it had very good reviews. From mm -hmm. I, I checked out the, the 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 pages, the web pages for for games, you know, mm -hmm. and they, you know, they they make reviews for it like they do on records, and it was very good, you know. Good. I'm not the guy who say can say if it's a good game or not but I don't play are. it <laughs> no I'm, I don't know games I know Trivial Pursuit and and you know I can play mm -hmm. China chess and blah 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 you know <laughs> but just that and just another big question now you're going to play on festivals mm -hmm. and it's very different to play on festivals and play live shows yeah it is you don't have sound check you don't you know it's like you go up and do It's more like a party play when you play in festivals. Mm -hmm. You can't plan as much as here. Mm -hmm. So this is our show. Yes. But in festivals, okay, it's your turn. Go. You know. Mm -hmm. It's okay, more well. like that. And it's, it's bigger. You know, it's yes, big, okay. big, big. I remember we played Hellfest with Judas, Judas Priest. I can imagine that. It's amazing. The amount of people. Yeah, it's like a serial. <laughs> <laughs> Just see hair everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> yes. And um, any plans next year? Going When we come home, we will start recording as soon as possible. Okay. The, the record. Yeah. And then I have some other things. I do other stuff also. I do some acting, you know. Yes. I also do uh, do uh, voices for cartoons. Really? Yeah. Wow, that's amazing! I yeah. didn't know that. Which cartoons? It's different. It's on Disney Channel, you know. In Disney Channel. Yeah. Okay. You. But of course, in the Swedish version. Uh -huh. yeah, yeah, but. And I just finished a musical called Rock of Ages. Mhm. Mm and we did 150 shows in Stockholm and Gothenburg. Wow. Yeah. So you don't dress at all. I'm very bad with it, but I I will try this summer to take some <laughs> some relax and do nothing <laughs> and do like other people sit and drink coffee speaking shit and, all <laughs> and beer in the afternoon. <laughs> yes, because yeah, but I will because Stockholm is is great in the summer. Yeah. Really, people think I don't know what you think, but many people has this. They think it's always cold, and we have. Also and polar not... in the street, you know. It's not like that. We have 30 degrees on now. Really? Yeah. And that's summer. more like but, this. <laughs> yeah. But in this in the winter though, it gets very very cold. Mm -hmm. You can get like 20 minus degrees, you know. It's like very extreme. Yeah. It's It's the seasons are very sharp. Mhm. Mm yeah, and here. the favorite theme of Andy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we can always talk about weather. Oh, he likes that? Yeah, <laughs> yes, of course. You can talk I, about anything. I think. Yeah, he's worried about the weather here in Mexico, so maybe you can tell him something. Oh, he, he, what, what is he worrying about? The, hot, the his hotness? Yes. Well, <laughs> it is hot. <laughs> But it depends what season. I've been here and it's been very cold in the morning, for example. Yes, but no minus 20 or... No, no. <laughs> we don't have that. And cold. not snow. No, we don't have snow. We have a lot. Yeah, I envy so much. You do. You want to see it someday? Yes, yeah. here never snow. It's like, it's always hot and... Yeah. Or maybe we can some rain, but just yeah. that. It's annoying. So, it's all... Are you satisfied with it? Um, well, I am. Good. Are you? Yeah, <laughs> very good. You want to speak... Did you put, did you put on, on record? Yes, I did. <laughs> <laughs> That's hey, that um, It's a secret. Nobody knows. But I think that that we all for now, and we will speak very soon. You will come to the concert. Ah, uh, yes, I am. Cool. So we will see you. Thank you. There and thank you so much. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you and see you very soon. Yes, sir. Okay. Bye. <laughs>